Here's how you can download and install Postcard Preset Bundle. This is the download screen that you'll be given. You just click this button here. I'm actually going to click the download button on this page, which is the download page you'll be given access to once you leave a review for Postcard Presets. By leaving a review for Postcard Presets, you'll unlock access to four additional bonus presets. Bali, which is vibrant, Canada, which is wintergreen, San Francisco, which is warm, and Seattle, which is moody. No matter what page you're on, you'll click the button and it will download a zipped folder to your downloads folder. It might come up with a funny name like this, don't worry about that, you can rename it. Make sure that you save it somewhere safe, not in your downloads folder. Your computer might automatically unzip the folder. I needed to double click mine to unzip it. Inside there is a PDF of a welcome guide with all the information on the free bonus presets if you leave a review, the info, installation and FAQs for both the desktop and the mobile presets. It's very helpful, so make sure you take a look at that. Make sure your Lightroom is up to date. I'm going to start installing in Lightroom Classic and then I'll show you how to install into Adobe Lightroom. Now, Adobe have made it really easy to install Lightroom presets into Lightroom. There are two ways you can do it. You can just click File and then Import Develop Profiles and Presets or in the Develop module, click on any image and then you'll click this little plus symbol and hit import presets. Now again, try and save it somewhere different than your downloads folder, but inside here you'll see a zipped file called desktop presets to install on desktop. You do not have to unzip this file. In fact, it's much easier and better to simply click import on the zipped file. All of the desktop presets will immediately show up like this. Now, I don't use Adobe Lightroom Classic to edit my mobile photos, but if you want to, again, click the plus symbol, import presets, and then this is the one for you, mobile presets to install on desktop. Again, it's a zipped file, no need to unzip it. You'll simply hit import, and the same thing will happen. Your postcard mobile presets will show up in Lightroom. Now jumping over to Adobe Lightroom, this is the app that we use to edit our mobile photos because it syncs so beautifully to the free Lightroom mobile app. But let's do the same thing. So start by clicking any image. In the top right hand corner, you'll open the edit module and you'll see there's a button here called presets. This will open up a new panel and you can click the three bubbles and import presets. Again, all you need to do is import the desktop presets zipped file. Which shows up like this. And you'll import the mobile presets install on desktop zipped file. Now that these are installed into Adobe Lightroom, it will sync over to your mobile and you'll be able to immediately start using the Lightroom mobile presets and desktop presets on the Lightroom mobile app. If you cannot see them coming up, we actually recommend uninstalling and then reinstalling Lightroom. It's a pain we know, but it really does work and it really will solve the problem that you're having. Another problem that we sometimes encounter with our presets is that some of the presets are hidden. So here on the desktop, you can go up to the three bubbles there's something called hide partially compatible presets. Sometimes when that is chosen, some of our presets will disappear because of the custom profiles we've created for them. All you need to do is uncheck that to make sure all of them show up. In both of these examples, in Adobe Lightroom and Adobe Lightroom Classic, you can see that there are the four bonus presets included. By leaving a review for postcard presets, you'll unlock access to four additional bonus presets. Thanks for watching this video and happy editing using your new postcard presets.